75 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour with gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. Severe thunderstorms will be near Melcher Dallas around 6.40 p.m. Other locations in the path of these severe thunderstorms include Baxter and Rock Creek Lake. This includes the following highways. Interstate 35 between mile markers 39 and 72 and between mile markers 87 and 101. Interstate 80 between mile markers 118 and 189. No. For your protection, you need to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central and Central Iowa. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties. In Iowa, Clark, Dallas, Jasper, Lucas, Madison, Maska, Marion, Monroe, Polk, Powashik, and Warren. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 6.45 p.m. for storage, Marshall, Harding, Eastern Lake, Western Franklin, Northeastern Coastal, Hancock, Southeastern Boone, Eastern Hamilton and Winnebago counties. At 6.34 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Alden to near Grundy Center, moving east at 85 miles per hour. Really? Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. These severe thunderstorms will remain over mainly rural areas of Story, Marshall, Harding, Eastern Wright, Western Franklin, Northeastern Kosuth, Hancock, Southeastern Boone, Eastern Hamilton and Winnebago counties, including the following locations, Wesley, Steamboat Rock, Ferguson, Forest City Municipal Airport, Radcliffe, Bradford, Maxwell, Cambridge, Melbourne and Buffalo Center. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for Central and North Central Iowa. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 6.45 p.m. for the following counties, in Iowa, Boone, Franklin, Hamilton, Hancock, Harding, Kosuth, Marshall, Story, Winnebago and Wright. This is a high wind warning for the following counties in Iowa, Adair, Boone, Clark, Dallas, Green, Guthrie, Jasper, Madison, Marion, Polk, Story and Warren. High wind warning remains in effect until midnight tonight. South to southwest wind 30 to 40 miles per hour with gusts of 60 to 70 miles per hour or greater possible. Winds will become more westerly later this evening. The areas affected include Iowa, when, from noon Wednesday to midnight Wednesday night. The following impacts are expected, damaging winds may blow down trees and power lines. Power outages are expected. Travel will be difficult, especially for high-profile vehicles such as semi-trucks, buses, and large hubs and vans. Fires may spread quickly, with blowing dust possible as well. People should avoid being outside in forested areas and around trees and branches. If possible, remain in the lower levels of your home during the windstorm, and avoid windows. Use extreme caution if you must drive. This is Noah All Hazards Weather Radio Station WXL 57 at Des Moines, Iowa, transmitting on 162.55 MHz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service at Des Moines, Iowa. The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Western Monroe County in South Central Iowa, Lucas County in South Central Iowa, Decatur County in South Central Iowa, Southwestern Marion County in South Central Iowa, Wayne County in South Central Iowa, Western Appanoose County in South Central Iowa, Clark County in South Central Iowa, Southern Warren County in South Central Iowa, until 7.15 p.m. At 6.13 p.m., 
severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near New Virginia to 7 miles southeast of Lamoni, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. These severe thunderstorms will remain over mainly rural areas of western Monroe, Lucas, Decatur, southwestern Marion, Wayne, western Appanus, Clark and southern Warren counties, including the following locations, Melrose, Red Hall Lake State Park, Pleasanton, Promise City, Clio, Williamson, Nine Eagle State Park, Decatur City, Umeston and Linville. This includes Interstate 35 between mile markers 4 and 44. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central Iowa. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.15 p.m. for the following counties, in Iowa, Appanus, Clark, Decatur, Lucas, Marion, Monroe, Warren and Wayne. This is NOAA All Hazards Weather Radio Station WXL 57 at Des Moines, Iowa. Transmitting on 162.55 MHz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service at Des Moines, Iowa. Tornado Watch number 563 remains in effect until 8 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Adair, Boone, Clark, Dallas, Green, Guthrie, Jasper, Madison, Marion, Polk, Story, and Warren. Remember, a tornado watch means the conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including tornadoes, large hail and damaging winds, in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets, or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. No. This is a high wind warning. I'm, for the following I'm getting loose. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go. No. Guys. No, me. Pop, it's going off, it's going off, it's going off. Alicia. EAS capture. EAS capture from Des Moines. See? The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning. Oh, my God.
severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from Meltzer, Dallas to 12 miles south of Corden, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected, expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include, Sheraton, Corden, Raspin Lake, Seymour, Russell, Alerton, Humeston, Linville, Lucas, Garden Grove, Woodburn, Williamson, Derby, Melrose, Promise City, Clio, Plano, Marysville, Pleasanton and Millerton. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central Iowa. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.15 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Appanus, Clark, Decatur, Lucas, Marion, Monroe, Warren and Wayne. This is NOAA All Hazards Weather Radio Station WXL 57 at Des Moines, Iowa, transmitting on 162.55 MHz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service at Des Moines, Iowa. The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Story County in Central Iowa, Marshall County in Central Iowa, Eastern Hardin County in Central Iowa, Southwestern Grundy County in Central Iowa, until 7.30 p.m. At 6.46 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Atlington to 8 miles southeast of State Center, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are Tornado Watch number 563 remains in effect until 8 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Adair, Boone, Clark, Dallas, Green, Guthrie, Jasper, Madison, Marion, Polk, Story and Warren. Remember, a tornado watch means the conditions are favorable for the development of severe weather, including tornadoes, large hail and damaging winds, in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets, or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Story County in Central Iowa, Marshall County in Central Iowa, Eastern Hardin County in Central Iowa, Southwestern Grundy County in Central Iowa, until 7.30 p.m. That's a long way. It's 6.46 p.m. Severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Atlington to 8 miles southeast of State Center, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. Severe thunderstorms will be near Marshalltown around 7 p.m. A tornado watch remains in effect for the warned area. Tornadoes can develop quickly from severe thunderstorms. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, act quickly and move to a place of safety inside a sturdy structure such as a basement or small interior room. This is a dangerous situation. These storms are producing widespread wind damage across portions of central Iowa. Seek shelter now inside a sturdy structure and stay away from windows. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for central and north central Iowa. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Grundy, Harding, Marshall, and Story. The severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Madison and Eastern Dallas counties is canceled. The storms which prompted the warning have moved out of the warned area. Therefore, the warning has been canceled. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central and Central Iowa. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.30 p.m. for Northwestern Monroe, Northern Lucas, Western Thalashik, Eastern Polk, Marion, Western Mohaska, Jasper, Northeastern Clark and Eastern Warren counties. 
at 6.48 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Baxter to 7 miles south of Knoxville, moving east at 75 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. Locations impacted. Locations impacted include Rock Creek Lake. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central and Central Iowa. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Clark, Jasper, Lucas, Maska, Marion, Monroe, Polk, Powashik, and Warren. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.15 p.m. for Western Monroe, Lucas, Eastern Decatur, Southwestern Marion, Wayne, Western Appanus, Eastern Clark and Southeastern Warren Counties. At 6.49 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from Melcher, Dallas to 12 miles south of Corton, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Sheraton, Corton, Raspin Lake, Seymour, Russell, Alerton, Umeston, Linville, Lucas, Garden Grove, Woodburn, Williamson, Derby, Melrose, Thomas City, Clio, Plano, Hello, Marysville, Pleasanton, and Millerton. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central Iowa. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.50 p.m. for the following counties. In Iowa, Clark, Decatur, Lucas,
storms are producing widespread wind Stop. damage across portions of central Iowa. Seek shelter now inside a sturdy structure and stay away from windows. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for central and north central Iowa. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning has been issued until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Grundy, Harding, Marshall, and Story. The severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Madison and Eastern Dallas counties is canceled. The storm yeah. which prompted the warning has moved out of the warned area. Yeah. Therefore, the warning has been canceled. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central and Central Iowa. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.30 p.m. for Northwestern Monroe, Northern Lucas, Western Palachite, Eastern Polk, Marion, Western Alaska, Jasper, Northeastern Clark, and Eastern Warren counties. At 6.48 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Baxter to 7 miles south of Knoxville, moving east at 75 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 70 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated threat. The following impacts are expected. Expect considerable tree damage. Damage is likely to mobile homes, roofs, and outbuildings. Locations impacted include Rock Creek Lake. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central and Central Iowa. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.30 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Clark, Jasper, Lucas, Mayaska, Marion, Monroe, Hole, Powashik, and Warren. A severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.15 p.m. for Western Monroe, Lucas, Eastern Decatur, Southwestern Marion, Wayne, Western Avenues, Eastern Clark, and Southeastern Warren Counties. At 6.49 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from Melcher, Dallas to 12 miles south of Corden, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Expected hazards include 60 miles per hour wind gusts. This is a radar indicated you much, much. The following impacts are expected. Expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Locations impacted include Sheraton, Corden, Raspin Lake, Seymour, Russell, Alerton, Humeston, Linville, Lucas, Garden Grove, Woodburn, Williamson, Derby, Melrose, Promise City, Clio, Plano, Marysville, Pleasanton, and Millerton. A tornado watch remains in effect until 8 p.m. for South Central Iowa. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a building. Repeating, a severe thunderstorm warning remains in effect until 7.15 p.m. for the following counties in Iowa, Avenues, Clark, Marion, Monroe, Warren, and Wayne. I'm just kidding! This is a high wind warning for the following counties in Iowa, Adair, Boone, Clark, Dallas, Green, Guthrie, Jasper, Madison, Marion, Hold, Story, and Warren. High wind warning remains in effect until midnight tonight. South to southwest winds 30 to 40 miles per hour with gusts of 60 to 70 miles per hour or greater possible. Winds will become more westerly later this evening. The areas affected include Iowa. When, from noon Wednesday to midnight Wednesday night. The following impacts are expected. Damaging winds may blow down trees in power lines. Power outages are expected. Travel will be difficult, especially for high-profile vehicles such as semi-trucks, buses, and large bus and vans. Fires may spread quickly, with blowing dust possible as well. People should avoid being outside in forested areas and around trees and branches. If possible, remain in the lower levels of your home during the windstorm, and avoid windows. Use extreme caution if you must drive. This is Noah All Hazards Weather Radio Station WXL 57 at Des Moines, Iowa, transmitting on 162.55 megahertz. This broadcast originates from the National Weather Service at Des Moines, Iowa. 
The National Weather Service in Des Moines has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Eastern Story County in Central Iowa, Marshall County in Central Iowa, Eastern Hardin County in Central Iowa, Southwestern Grundy County in Central Iowa, until 7.30 p.m. At 6.46 p.m., severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Atlington to 8 miles southeast of State Center, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Effective hazards include 70 miles per hour with guns. I don't know. This is a radar indicator threat. 